Did I frighten you? Ah, the name is Bootsy Baby. And I want to tell you a little story about back in the day on the road with the fellas. Well, in this case, with p All right, so this is the way it goes. We make sure we get mug shots like this because we had mug shots all over Canada. We used to have to go over there this almost every day because George lived there and that's where we rehearsed. So all the fellas in one car, all stuffed in the car, we would go back and forth over to Canada. So what was happening was they, we became regulars and becoming regulars every time we came to the border, the cross, you know, they had to, you know, if you look like you was cool, you could go on through, you know, which we used to get there and we used to see everybody getting on through. When we came up, they would always just say, oh, it's you guys, right over there. So they, they would tell us to go over there because, you know, of course they had to search us, okay? I don't know why. And, you know, it wasn't even a question of, is it because we're black? Because that wasn't even in the, uh, you know, in our minds, you know. It was just because we was weird. We were weird, dressing weird, you know. So they just wanted to check us. They took us in there and they started checking us. And next thing we know, we got busted. <laughs> So we got busted one time, right? They took George back in the back. They put the rubber gloves on and they found the weed, okay? It was a very sad day in Funksville. So once that happened, every time we came to the border, we got checked automatically. One time I got busted. We had to go to court. All the fellas, you know, had to pay to get out of jail. It was a mess. But that's my funk story for the day. So if you're going over to Canada, and if you don't want a mug shot like this, then stay clean. Keep your nose free of anything that's not allowed, okay? If it ain't illegal, or if it's legal, it don't matter, okay? If you look as crazy as most of them fellas did, you're going to jail. All right, that's my story for today. Okay, bye. Bye.